Hey everyone, Eamon here, back with another three-body problem reaction. We are on episode five, it looks like. Yeah, episode five. Um, yeah, it's been about... How long has that been? Like, four or five days, I guess, since I watched episode four? Might have been longer than that, actually, so I'm kind of blanking on what just happened. Um, oh yeah, it was the, inter yeah, the interview with... Uh... Oh man, what's her name? <laughs> I forget her name. Ye Ye Wenji. That was, that's what it is. Ye Wenji. Yeah, and it, the episode ended with her being uh, interviewed. Um, not, not, yeah, interviewed. Not, not interviewed. Man, my brain is not working right now. Interrogated. Oh my god. I cannot believe that took me that long to figure that out. I probably just edited that out, but that, I just sat there for like 20 seconds trying to think of the word. Okay. Yeah, so I ended, ended up with Ye Wenji being interrogated. Um, and she said like that crazy line at the end, um, you, you will be grateful or something when they come, um, crazy stuff. Um, we are getting to the point in the season where it definitely seems like it's straying more towards, uh, some book two stuff that I haven't seen. So I'm really excited for that because yeah, the first few episodes, I kind of knew where the plot was going and all that. And yeah, obviously with, with them, um, introducing more season two or bo more book two, I think someone mentioned book three as well. There's some elements from that being uh, layered into this now. So that's really exciting for me because I haven't um, read the books, obviously. I've just seen the, the Tencent version of uh, book one. So yeah, I'm really excited to see how that goes. Um, it'll be definitely more of like an actual reaction, I guess, for me. Um, yeah, it was a little weird to react to this at the start because I knew I knew like this, the main plot points and all that. So it wasn't like a super, I don't know. You guys have liked my reactions, right? I think <laughs> those of you that are watching, but I think it'll be it'll be better once I know less about what's going on for sure. Um, I'll be a bit more uh, shocked and like mind blown, I guess. Um, but yeah, really enjoying the show. It's I don't want to say it's better than the Tencent version so far, but it's it's close. Like it's really it's a lot more like jam packed with stuff happening, and it's less. Um, it's easier to watch is the probably the best way it's, it's an easier watch it, it almost felt like watching the tens inversion felt like kind of like doing not doing homework but like i had to be like locked in to like understand what was going on so this is definitely an easier watch while still being like obviously like really cool sci-fi uh stuff so um yeah let's just hop into it um i did if anyone's interested i made a discord server um it was mainly because of my other channel where I do like sports reactions. Um, that channel is relatively um, popular, I guess. And yeah, so I had a lot of people in there that are saying I should make a Discord. Um, I did make a TV and movie section. Uh, no one has joined it yet that is from my TV movie channel. But if you want to get in there, be one of the first ones in there. Um, I guess if you want to like chat with me, you can um, in there probably easier and like discuss the shows you're watching. Um, yeah it's it's not really, the channel isn't very fleshed out but yeah like you can you can choose your tv role so you don't you don't you won't see the uh the sports stuff in there and all that um yeah be cool if people are in there um yeah i guess i can i can i don't know well yeah i don't know if the channel grows more well uh it'll be more of more use for the tv section as of now it's mainly just like for the sports stuff that i'm doing um but yeah if you're interested hop in there it's in the description um I guess we could probably yeah once there's people in there we can do like a poll for the next show i do type, type stuff like that we can we can do in there it's a bit easier for me than doing like community posts on youtube and stuff those are kind of i, I didn't even know those were a thing and i was on youtube i've been watching youtube forever and i had no idea that was a thing so yeah i'm sure lots of you guys don't know us either as, as well um yeah anyways uh yeah sub if you're not subbed like the video if you end up liking it comment stuff i should like should know if I miss it in the, the throughout the episode. Um, yeah, let's just hop into it. Commodore Williams said I'd find you here. Is there a problem, sir? Okay, it's this guy. Your first command. Interesting. I ask what this is about. Top man of the last ten years, according to Admiral Kennan. You're the bell at the ball. I'm not asking for the press release. I'm asking what you think. I yeah. think you're not my superior officer, sir. Why would I? And I'm the busiest man you ever met. Spend hours talking to your commanding officer. But I don't discuss highly sensitive naval operations with strangers. If you ask to see my ID, I'll know you're a sackless wonder like every other top Navy man I ever met. <laughs> May I see your ID, sir? <laughs> oh. Okay, what does that mean? This ship was designed for 20th century conflict, Mr. <laughs> okay, well... 
okay, I guess he's saw, like, yeah, he obviously knows what that means then, what he saw there. Um, yeah, interesting. Why did you join the Navy? To defend my country. What I'm sure so. for is far more important. Ooh. What an intro, okay. That's awesome. Yeah, I wonder what, uh, what Jin is gonna think about that. I'm assuming she'll find out, right? You said they weren't coming for over 400 years. How do you know they're gonna be nice? Nice. <laughs> 15th of August, 1977, E.T. found out. <laughs> I love Benedict Wand. Benedict, Benedict Wand. Reply from the aliens. Yes. From the Santi listener who received my message. This will be bad for your people, but you did it anyway. I did. Why? Because our civilization is no longer capable mm. of solving its own problems. Can't say I disagree with that. Too much, uh, yeah. Sorry, guys, I said to pop out for a second. We're back. Jin does not look good. I need the pop right to them, so. They feel anxiety. I know. I have anxiety. I know. <laughs> People are trying to kill us, and maybe aliens are trying to kill us. I know, but I'm sure they're not meant to be popped like candy. Augie, I love you, but can you fuck off? <laughs> I think Jin's my favorite character, other than um, now that uh, Jack's gone. Jin's pretty, pretty fun. I thought I knew Vera's mom. She was like my sweet old auntie. <laughs> That's crazy. Like with strings, um, what's the puppets? Puppets. <laughs> How do I forget that word? The Lord allowed you to capture me, which means I'm no longer valuable. No, it's not a threat. Hmm. Okay. What she about is? Evans? Does he still matter to your lord? Right in assuming he's Vera's father. Only in the biological sense. Oh what? That that's not in the book, right? We no no we know we know who Vera's father was. It was but it was well before, um, wasn't it? Yeah, it it wasn't it wasn't uh, Evans in the in the book. They must have changed that. Out, did it? Yeah, I definitely wouldn't call him the good cop. Maybe Evans told them. She never met him. The first time he ever looked at her, she was in her coffin. Oh, I thought I was a shit dad. I'm sure you are. <laughs> why recruit Jin Chong? Oh, okay, that's why. She could be okay. the most capable physicist of her generation. There is one thing we can't figure out. Just one thing. <laughs> it takes four years for a radio signal to get from our planet to their planet, correct? And another four to get a response. Unless? There is a faster way to communicate. Is Impossible it? for us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Those are really good scenes there. European mutt. Boring as fuck. <laughs> Except for this bit. I'm 1% Mongolian. We're practically brothers. <laughs> she underestimates us. Either that or we're fucked. <laughs> if you were right about Evans, keeping a record of his communications with the Santee. He kept it. Like the word of the Lord is like the Bible to him. We need that Bible. It's somewhere on Judgment Day. That's the only safe place to keep it. How do we neutralize everyone aboard the ship without damaging the data? Are they doing this in this episode? Okay, they're doing, okay, they're doing okay. They're gonna do that this episode. Missile strike. In fact, did you know the Judgment Day just booked a slot at the Panama Canal Authority for next month? Yeah, if they're doing the scene I think they're doing this episode, that is crazy. Um, I think that was in the finale of the Tencent version, so... Yeah, that is wild if they do what I think they're gonna do. A moment like this is a great test of faith. Has your faith been tested? The Lord speaks with me every day. Not anymore. This raid was no surprise. If our comrades in England were captured or killed, that is all part of the Lord's plan. Yeah, that isn't really. I'll see you later for dinner. Calm the nerves, though. If I'm that guy, like. We never lied to you, Lord. Doesn't matter. Never. The ability to lie is too Please much. Speak to us again. Is this antique show? <laughs> oh, it's yeah. good in this Fuck. one. Holy shit! <laughs> Why would you sneak up on me like that? We need you to resume production on the nanofibers. You're scared. I get it. You're right to be scared. But we have got one shot to stop these fuckers. Oh my god. I need a drink. <laughs> wow. Mm. 
Hmm. No, it's gonna show up, right? I'm gonna jump scare us with the. Hmm. I guess the assumption there would be that they they want her, her to do what she's gonna do. Why oh. didn't they come back? I think the Lord stopped protecting his flock. Yeah. You, when you've succeeded, there'll be no medals, no public recognition, no glory. He's a real prick, isn't he? <laughs> Who says he's real? <laughs> What's he up to? Solicitors, the estate of Jack Rooney. Ah. I left you half of his estate, which, after taxes, amounts to almost 20 million pounds. Beautiful location you here. I'm starving. Okay. Yeah, yeah they're doing what I think they're doing. Hello? All on track? Yes, sir. 26 hours to Judgment Day. I'm not sure this is Commander Verma's forte. Double check his work. I don't trust her. Triple check all her work. <laughs> <laughs> How many people are on that ship? I don't know. Later, it could be a pretty small crew. Just give me a guess. I don't know. You want it to work. Of course I want it to work. Even though you don't know how many people we're going to kill, their names are, or why they deserve to die. But I know it's important. I'm not like you. I didn't sign up for this. I think we're at war. This must be a real place, right? This would be crazy to go through on a ship. Show the kids. Jesus Christ. I don't want to see that. I don't, in the Tencent version, I don't think there was kids on board, what was from what I remember, so that makes it a little more drip? horrifying. Gee, look at that. You gotta lay down, man. Okay, they're not totally showing the kids. That is crazy, though. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. You gotta lay down. Lay down and you live. We're under attack. You gotta go, buddy. You're gonna you're gonna die right now. Oh fuck. He's done so. Yeah. Is he gonna cut it in half? My lord. Okay, no, it didn't get it didn't get cut, it doesn't look like. Jesus though. The whole ship's gonna break though, right? Yeah. Oh my god. Jeez, I need to see a side by side of this with the Tencent version. They both looked insane. Yeah. Jeez, man. I guess I'll pause for a second. Yeah, the, that whole the whole sequence of this episode, the Tencent version was a lot more um, like most of the show it was a lot more fleshed out. Where they they came, they like explained what was going to happen before they did it kind of so, so the whole thing was laid out this one they kind of rushed it i mean i guess if i didn't know it was going to happen i'd probably be able to deduct what, what they're planning but yeah it's obviously yeah that's insane congratulations dr salazar 
She did not want to hear the congrats there. So she'll feel, she'll feel even more responsible. Okay, the hard drive that he took didn't get cut in half, so that's good for them. There's still three episodes left too, so that means they might make may, it to like listen to all the combos they've had, which would be sick. So you're gonna see a kid? Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, I don't know how you can, like, come back from, like, feeling responsible for that, like. Let's go. <laughs> Is it, oh, it, it did get cut. Oh, wait, did it? No, it didn't. Okay, it didn't. Still nothing. It's only been two weeks. Only? 3.8 trillion years. <laughs> fuck about. Could strike it lucky. Jesus, okay, so it's it's heavily encrypted. Brute force cryptography just isn't gonna... Nope. Oh, did it? It's open. Hmm. You didn't do anything. It opened because they want us to see what's inside. Yeah, yeah, I was about to say that. Three bodies, so fun. Not familiar with the file type. Ooh. Holy. It's a hundred petabytes. Is that the game? That's the game, right? That no, that's the game. It a hundred million gigabytes. The sound it made. Oh, you wouldn't have liked it. Like God's fingernails scraping the oh my. Board. That's a good, uh, that's a good analogy. Anyway, analogy. sorry for your loss. Although it sounds like he wasn't much help around the house. Did they let us do this too? Why would they let us destroy their ship and kill your boyfriend? I know they're coming to save us from ourselves. I know they're the only ones who can. Is he going to play the... You? Am I under arrest? He's going to play the, the last convo they had, potentially. It's a recording of the conversations between Evans and your lord here. Oh, Have a listen. okay, let's go. Find out what your we, didn't, we didn't get to hear this at all in the tense really version. Think of you. Are you going to show it? Come on, show us. Show us. I'd sit here for half an hour listening to this. Come on. Please, don't, don't, don't skip. Okay, good. Can't you ever say anything that you know to be false? Mm -hmm. Can't you lie? You do this? You lie? Well, I try not to, but, um, yeah, yeah, we all do. Sometimes, one way or another. We think we understand now. A liar is someone whose words are false. A liar cannot be trusted. Mm -hmm. We cannot coexist with liars. Mm -hmm. We are afraid of you. Lord. My lord. Jeez. Yeah, that's crazy. They, did, they didn't show that in the Tensor version, obviously. So that's, yeah. That would shatter her whole, like, she, she now knows that, or she can, she can assume that, like, they're just going to wipe out humans. Like, they're, they can't, they can't be, they can't coexist with them. So she's realizing that, yeah. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Most people would be flattered that the boss came to pick them up for work. You're not my boss. <laughs> you are now. Or he is now. Commander Varma tells me you understand extra dimensions. Higher dimensions? Higher dimensions. You understand that kind of thing? Nobody really understands that kind of thing. To the extent we are capable of understanding them, yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> is it another level of the game? Could be. Okay, what are we going to see here? I'm so excited. How do we get it started? Man, what is this going to be? What is this going to be? Fuck. <laughs> Yep. That's her. Okay. They look like us. We don't look anything like this. You wouldn't like it. Why did you bring us here? To tell you that we're doomed. Our species is doomed. Why? How long will the fleet take to reach Earth? 400 years. That's why we're doomed. It's the information age. 50 years. And how long do you think it took us to get from hunting to farming? A lot longer. It will be 400 years before we reach you. By the time we do, you will have long surpassed us. You will destroy our fleet and then come back and destroy our world to make sure we never threaten you again. Unless you figure out a way to disarm us. Have you? Yes. We will do it with our Sophons. 
What is this so fun? Oh yeah, that's what, okay. I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember. One we have turned into a sentient computer. The universe has more dimensions than the three we occupy. Folded up far too small for us to see. But we have the technology to unfold them. Even a tiny proton becomes something very large indeed. Awake and aware. I understand my purpose. I am ready to return to my original side. Jesus Christ. We used all our resources to make four sofons. Each pair is entangled. Connected on the quantum level. The other two we've sent to you. Everything they see in here, we see in here at the same time. Even when they are light years apart. A proton has virtually no mass. They entered your solar system months ago. To the places where your best minds explore reality at its most fundamental level. Why are they telling this to us though is what I want to know. And we will destroy the science that could defeat us. Looks so cool. These visuals the are so sick. Will a mystery to you forever. We make you see what we want you to see. This is so all trippy. Watching, learning all your secrets. And we will teach you how to fear again. That is crazy. Jeez. Okay, that whole sequence was way better in the in this version than the Tencent version. Um yeah, that was so creepy. But I don't know why they told us that. Um, that seems weird, I guess. Just to flex on us? Like, what, what was the, what's the goal of showing that to everyone? I don't know. It's the bugs thing? I think, the, 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 yeah. You are bugs. Yeah, crazy. It's, there's still three episodes left. Okay, this is, this is like how the Tenzin version ended. That's crazy. announcing themselves to the world. <laughs> Ooh, that's a sick visual. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez. Who's this? Oh, it's her. That's, uh, yeah, that's a lady from... <laughs> She's like the only one left. Jeez. Man. All right. Well, that was that was insane. Um yeah, that was how the show ended in um the Tenzin version. Um it, they didn't do the whole like mirroring of the of the world thing at the end there, but they did the we are bugs thing and then the show has ended. So that's crazy. It's episode 5 they're doing that. So there's still 3 episodes left. Man, I'm so excited. I'm after like yeah, I might have to like just bang out the next few episodes in the next day or two. Um, yeah, that that is crazy. Um, yes, yeah, so let, let's backtrack a bit. Yeah, so the Tencent version, they did they spent like a whole episode like explaining and setting up the whole uh, nano fiber ship scene. That was like the huge yeah that was like a hugely long uh, sequence in the sh in the Tencent version. This one they kind of they kind of blew through it. It was still insane, still. Uh, probably even more graphic than, than the Tencent version, I think. Yeah, it was pretty, pretty scary. And they, I don't think in the Tencent version, they showed that there was like families and kids on the boat in the Tencent version. So that makes it extra, like there's like hundreds of kids. They just got like straight up murdered just then, which is, yeah, that's obviously insane. Uh, kind of, kind of leads to, to Ye, uh, Ye Wenji's uh, whole humans can't be saved. If they're going to do that, even if it's to save the species, that's still kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, the whole we are bugs thing, the, the, the Sophon, Siphon, Sophon, 
yeah that scene was also like insane in the in the tenth version but i think they did a better job here in uh in this um it was a lot more scary with them like talking to the humans directly about it um yeah that was pretty wild i guess at this point i have no idea what's gonna happen next at all i was kind of expecting it to kind of slowly get to this point and then the finale would end with this but yeah there's still three episodes left and i have no idea what's gonna happen now because i think we're pretty much caught up with um with book one i guess is yeah i think we're we pretty much there's anything missing from book one that is like really important that we didn't hear i don't even yeah i can't think of anything so it's i'm pretty much going blind the next few episodes um I guess there's the, um, what's his name that has cancer? I, sorry, I keep forgetting his name, but he, yeah, I gotta think he's gonna survive. Um, he seems like he's, his character is kind of not very important through the, the season so far, so I think he's gonna somehow play a bigger part. Um, they'll figure out how to save him somehow, maybe with the alien technology, I don't know. Um, and then yeah the, the lady that got away she's like the only or i mean there's probably more but she's like one of the few uh followers that is alive so i mean i don't know what her role would really be because obviously the the santi don't like trust humans anymore so i don't know if she would actually be that important but yeah um and then i guess we'll see uh, what's her name? Uh, Ye Wenji, pretty much her whole view of the Santi now is like ruined. So she's, she might end up switching sides because yeah, obviously she's the one like the world's going to end. Humanity is going to end because of her at this point. So maybe she'll somehow, uh, become involved again in helping the good guys out. I don't know. I'm like, I have no theories really. Like I remember watching the, like the Tenzin version and when it ended, I was just like, well, like we're fucked like how how the hell are we gonna like yeah like there's no possible way for us to win unless there's some sort of like they would have to fumble if they have like santi would have to fumble it somehow maybe maybe the sofon um like it's it's ai sort of right it's like a computer a or is it ai no it's like it's computer maybe it somehow becomes like more sentient or sentient and helps humans i i have no idea i honestly can't even i think i need more info before i can come up with like a theory so maybe after the next episode i'll come up with some more uh some more stuff because yeah there's like all i can really think of is that we're we're screwed <laughs> that, that's that's all i don't see any possible way that humanity can like yeah like maybe they can make they can make like some hidden part of the world that's like immune to the sofon that can like be used for scientists to advance the world over the next 400 years like that's i don't even that's all i've got really um yeah uh i think we'll just end it there insane episode um i think i did see some comments about people talking about this episode being insane so i didn't remember those comments until like midway through but yeah obviously that that was a crazy episode people that haven't seen the show at all would probably be absolutely mind blown i like i was mind blown and i already knew this this plot line um but yeah we'll just wrap it up uh thanks for watching uh join the discord if you're interested there's no one in there yet from the tv side of my uh youtube uh journey but um yeah join join it join it uh maybe in a couple weeks it'll be more active or something i don't know we'll, we'll see how it goes um yeah, and then, yeah, if you're not sub, make sure to sub, like the video, comment, stuff I might have missed, your thoughts on this episode. Um, I've mentioned a few times, but if, if, if this is your first three-body experience, um, I'm really curious to know what you thought. Um, because I think lots of people that are watching the show have seen, or at least people that are watching reactions have probably seen the Tencent version already or have read the books. So you guys probably weren't as shocked, but if there are some of you that haven't seen, this is your first, like, yeah, then let me know. I'm very curious. Um, I'm actually going to go talk to my mom about it because uh, Three Body was her, or this, this Netflix version was her first uh, time watching anything to do with Three Body. So uh, I got to go talk with her about this episode right now because that was, that was insane. Um, and yeah, we'll just. Anything else? Yeah, no, we'll wrap it up. Thanks for watching. See ya.